वेलकम स्टूडेंट्स टू द एलेवेंथ स्टैंडर्ड केमिस्ट्री चैप्टर इज बेसिक प्रिंसिपल्स ऑफ ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री स्टूडेंट्स इन केमिस्ट्री सब्जेक्ट ऑफ अवर एलेवेंथ स्टैंडर्ड वी हैव स्टडीड वेरियस ब्रांचेस ऑफ केमिस्ट्री एंड ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ब्रांच विच डील्स विद स्टडी ऑफ कंपाउंड्स of carbon due to catenation property of carbon we know students it can form large number of compounds and to study these all types of compounds we have to classify these compounds in different types here the basic thing we have to study that representation of structural formula in our previous standard we have seen definition of hydrocarbons compounds in which only hydrogen and carbon are constituent elements are there this type of compounds are called as hydrocarbons how to write molecular formula of hydrocarbon that also we know structural formula structural formula means right structure of that compound means writing or showing all bonds between carbon and constituent elements for example we have different types or different ways of representation that is dash formula or complete structural formula expanded formula we can say second is condensed formula again condensed formula we can say condensed formula a condensed formula b last is zigzag formula or bond line formula in dash line formula students all bonds between carbon atoms and carbon and hydrogen or carbon and other elements are shown means single covalent bond is shown by single line between carbon and carbon carbon and hydrogen etc in condensed formula a and b either these bonds are not shown means directly ch3 ch2 ch2 ch3 is written or sometimes what is done instead of writing all ch2 ch2 separately we write ch2 and two as suffix because there are two ch2 neighboring means there are two types of condensed formula a and b both types we are going to write here and zigzag line zigzag line formula or bond line formula means hydrocarbon or compound is written in zigzag manner where corners or terminals represents the carbon separately c for the carbon is not written hydrogen is also not shown in zigzag line it is considered that to balance the tetravalency of carbon hydrogens are there if other than carbon and hydrogen are there they are shown so students we have some five questions in this table and in different manner is one way of representation they have given in our question remaining three columns we have to write for example first is they have given dash formula ch3 ch2 ch2 ch3 means there are total four carbon atoms and 10 hydrogen atoms we have write condensed formula a condensed formula b and zigzag or bond line formula let us start here we can see condensed formula a means the middle ch2 or ch is written once and the suffix is written we can see ch3 is there i will write ch3 CH2 is two times. Therefore, what I will write? 
CH2 two times. Try to understand. CH2 two times. What is that? The last part it is CH3. Therefore, this is the condensed formula A representation of the first compound. In B, what is it? We just hide single bonds of the dash formula. Means we show CH3. We don't show the carbon and hydrogen bonds. CH2, CH2, CH3. We just show the single bond between carbon. Zigzag line. Please see students. One, two, three, four carbons. Okay. One, two, three, four carbons. And as I said, carbon and hydrogen are not shown. It is automatically the C and to saturate in the valence of carbon. One bond is there between carbon and carbon. C H three remaining three are hydrogen. C two bonds are already there. Therefore, it is C H two. C two bonds are there. Therefore, remaining two hydrogens are there. And C one bond is shown. Therefore, remaining are automatically three hydrogens. This is the zigzag formula or bond line formula of the compound. I hope you all have understood this type of representation of structural formula. Let us go for second students. What is given? CH three. CH two times. CH3. We should understand, students, that if CH2 is there, CH2, CH2, there is a single bond in between. If CH is written and it is two times, it means there is a double bond between two carbons. Therefore, structural the dash formula will be CH3. CH, CH. How many times CH is there? Two times. Double bond. CH, CH three. CH three. Remember, tetravalency of carbon should be maintained. Here, CH three. CH. Double bond CH CH three. Total four carbon atoms are there, students. Therefore, one, two, three, four, and there is a double bond between carbon number two and three. Double bond between one, two, three, four. Second and third carbon there is a double bond. Therefore, this is the Zigzag line formula or bond line formula of the molecule. Third, again, what is written? CH three, CH two two times CH. So first CH three, all bonds will show CH two two times CH two again CH two. Last is CH four. This is aldehyde functional group C H O. H is single bonded and O is double bonded. Okay. When writing condensed formula, same C H three double bond C H two again sorry, single bond C H two single bond C H two. Last is C H O C. Double bond O H. C double bond O H. Bond line formula. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. CH three, CH two, CH two, CH double bond O. CH double bond O. 
ओके दिस इज सी एस डबल वन ओ और वी कैन राइट लाइक दिस आल्सो ओके स्टूडेंट्स नेक्स्ट सी एच थ्री सी एच टू सी एच सी एच थ्री ओ एच व्हाट इज ब्रैकेट इज शोन दिस ब्रैकेट शो दैट दिस सी एच थ्री दैट इज टू प्रीवियस कार सो प्लीज सी एस फ्रेंड्स सी एच थ्री सी एच टू सी एच देर इज एच सी एस थ्री एट बॉटम सी एच थ्री देर ओ एच कंडेस फॉर्मूला बी विल बी सी एच थ्री सिंगल बॉन्ड सी एच सिंगल बॉन्ड सॉरी सी एच टू सिंगल बॉन्ड सी एच सी एच थ्री एंड ओच वन टू थ्री वन टू थ्री ओके सी एच थ्री सी एच टू सी एच देर विल बी सी एच थ्री एंड हियर ओच सी एच थ्री सी एच टू सी एच सी एच थ्री एंड ओच रिमेम्बर स्टूडेंट्स दिस वॉज द जिग्जैक और वर्ल्ड लाइन फॉर्मूला ऑफ द स्ट्रक्चर लास्ट ए ट्रिपल वर्ल्ड सी सी एच C O H C triple bond N. So formula will be the condensed formula A will be N C C H O H will be in bracket and C N. Condensed formula B N C C H O H C N. Here, students, there will be only one, two, three carbonates. First carbonate is triple bonded with nitrogen. One, two, three. Third carbonate is also triple bonded with nitrogen. One, two, three. And second carbonate is Having O H bond, okay. So students, this is the zigzag or bond-like structure of the compound. So we have studied the meaning of dash formula, condensed formula A, condensed formula B, and zigzag formula or bond-like formula. We have solved some structures for examples for better understanding of these types of representations. Okay. Further. Practice examples we will see in next video students. Thank you very much.